Here we'll show you step-by-step -step instructions on how to install Evolve. First, insert Evolve DVD Disk 1 into your computer. Here you'll find the documentation folder and the installation files. Select the install type for your operating system, .app for Mac and .exe for Windows. You can also choose to install the Native Instruments Service Center by itself here as well. You will be prompted where you would like Evolve to be installed. Usually this is a Program Files folder on a PC or the Applications folder on a Mac. I'm going to choose DP Drive. From the drop-down menu, you can choose to select Easy Install and Custom Install. Easy Install will install the Contact 2 Player software as well as the Evolve instrument and library. If you opt to use Custom Install, you can choose which of these components you would like to install separately. You will then be asked to choose where you would like to install the library. This will be placed under a Heaviosity Evolve directory. For optimum performance, we suggest installing the library on a separate drive that only houses the samples. After you've chosen the location of the library, it will start to install. The total install time should take about 5 to 10 minutes total. You may notice that your computer might seem to freeze or hang up at 199. This is normal. It is actually still installing and may hang on to that number for a while. Once you've finished, you will be prompted to install the Native Instrument Service Center. If you already have the Service Center installed, you can skip this step. Once the installation of Disk 1 is complete, you can eject the disk and insert Evolve Disk 2. When you open Disk 2, you will find one file, evolve underscore 003.nkx. This file has the rest of Evolve samples and is the last step to the installation process. Navigate to your Heaviosity Evolve folder and copy the evolve underscore 003.nkx file into that directory. This is an important final step because Evolve will not find those instruments unless that file is copied over into that directory. When that file is done copying, the Evolve installation is complete.